welcome back to my channel today's video it's going to be a tutorial on this easy and affordable Halloween look so if you want to see how I create this look just keep on watching on my eyes today I am going to be using the modern metals eyeshadow palette by elf and using a elf brush I am going to be applying this um, shimmery eyeshadow in my brow bone on a fluffy brush I am going to take this yellow eyeshadow and I am going to blend it all over my crease Using the same brush, I am going to take this light brown shadow and I am going to place it on top of the yellow shade. Sigma E25 I am going to take the same eyeshadow and I am going to blend it into my inner and outer corner of the eye. Using the same brush I am going to take this dark um, purple eyeshadow and I am going to blend it into the inner and outer part of the eye. concealer I am going to create a halo eye Using my e.l.f. concealer brush, I am going to take this um, gold eyeshadow and I am going to apply it right on top of the concealer. And to create a gradient effect, I am going to be using this bronze eyeshadow. Now we're gonna move on to face and as primer I am going to be using the Milk Makeup Luminous Blur Stick and the foundation I am using is the Milk Makeup Blur Liquid Foundation. I am using the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Beautiful Bronze. For concealer, I am using the Milk Makeup Flex Concealer.
As a base for my highlighter, I am using the Holographic Stick by Milk Makeup. To set my concealer, I am using the Pop Beauty Setting 101. To set my foundation, I am using the Milk Makeup Translucent Powder. Now we're gonna move on to the scary part. First, I am going to be using this uh, liquid latex and I am going to be applying that into my neck using a brush. On top, I am going to be applying tissue paper and I am going to let it dry. And right here, using a sponge, I am um, damping or applying more latex on top of the paper. <laughs> using a Q-tip, I am going to um, apply a little bit of latex on my face to create like a scarf or a cut on my cheek. And right now the latex is, is dry already so I am going to create a cut in the middle. I am using scissors but I do not recommend to use scissors and if you're gonna do it just please be very careful. And right now I am going to do the same thing in my cheek and I'm being super careful the scissors are not touching my skin.
right now I am going to apply lashes you don't have to use lashes if you don't want to I just love lashes every day or every time I do my makeup I like to apply lashes Using this paint palette by Wet n Wild, I am going to use a sponge and I am going to be applying this light brown paint all over my neck. Using the same sponge, I am going to be layering uh, a brown a brown and using a fluffy brush I am going to take this uh, maroon paint and I am going to apply it all over my neck as well And I am going to do the same thing in my cheek. Now I am going to take this vampire blood and I am going to apply it all over my neck. You can apply it and blend it with the sponge and apply a little bit more. You can decide whatever you want. And that is it you guys. Here is the complete look. I hope you all enjoyed this video. And if you did, please don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. And I will see you all in my next video.